Hey guys, so last year, last August 1st, I poured concrete for my new shop, Arcade. Uh, some of you that followed uh, were following that at the time, but that was August 1st of last year. This thing is a behemoth, it's huge. It's ginormous. So one of the main reasons I wanted to build this was so I could share this collection uh, with tournaments and leagues and friends, um, and it turned out amazing. For the first time ever in nine years since I've joined the pinball league, uh, I was able to host. Uh, and that was one of the biggest goals I wanted out of building this shop. So uh, although it's not completely finished yet, it was, it was done enough to host this league on August 10th. And I want to take you inside and show you the progress. So come on, let's go. So I decided not to go on the back door. <coughs> I wanted to bring you through the front door so you can see what everybody else sees when they first walk up to the shop. So let's check this out. So, like I said, it's not completely done, but I'm super happy with what I've gotten accomplished so far. You can see I got a great collection in here. They're not all mine, uh, but this is a great space for hanging out and, and uh, playing some pinball. But uh, I want to show you some closer things um, and, and kind of talk about them. The paint job, for one. Like, I love this paint job. Uh, definitely uh, late 70s, early 80s, but I've got the paint splatters on there, just like on this wall over here. Uh, this one is so roller skating rink retro. Uh, I got the lights down, but some of that is UV paint and it's just splattered everywhere. I had so much fun painting that. Um, but eventually there will be a bar there. So let's check some other things out. My light bright wall. I love this wall. It turned out great. And check out the trapper keeper. This is where I put the patterns and the pegs. The pegs, these pegs go in this. Uh, pocket and then boom there's the patterns I'm so happy with this say what so the shop's a bit of a mess uh, because I've been working on games since league but I want to show you one of my favorite things in this shop and I'm so happy with it the scoreboard and in between rounds check this out this thing is not rated for the amount of power I have going through this but this is what sounds the buzzer dude isn't that cool so overall, this shop turned out amazing. I got a lot of compliments. There's still a lot of little work to do, trim and painting walls. Those back walls aren't painted yet, but man, this shop came together and I busted my butt for a year, a solid year, getting this to the point of hosting league on August 10th. And I'm so happy uh, with how this turned out. More to come, but now I can start making more TikToks. This shop and the military have kept me so busy I haven't done many TikToks. So thanks for watching this and, and please follow because I'm going to make more TikToks in this really cool space. Wait, wait, I, for, I forgot some stuff. I got to show you the bathroom. I'm super happy with the bathroom. Let's go, let's go check out the bathroom. So back here is the bathroom. Yeah, I do have a bathroom. Check out this little gym. I think it's beautiful. I love it. I got the black and white checkered floors. It's got a like a bubblegum pink and red. I had this picture, I had to, like, I made this bathroom based off this picture, and then I got some really cool pictures that don't fit, but I love them. Um, yeah, really cool. And then check out the little towel holder I have. Oh, I love this. This bathroom is perfect. Yeah, this, I'm super happy with this shop. Oh, and one more thing, one more thing, one, one, one more, one more, and then you can go do whatever you wanna do. The bike, the ET bike. Some of you may have saw that TikTok kind of messed me over with that, the TikTok of that bike, but I got the ET bike, which is gonna go great with that artwork. So now we can say thanks for watching.